Hello, I'm going to talk to you to show you how to set up your all-in-one terminal within Symfony in EMC. You will need EMC installed on your computer or laptop, a log on to EMC, as well as the name of your organisation and the name of your store, outlet, restaurant or cafe in Symfony. You'll also need the IP address, something like 192.168.1.5 of the all-in-one device, which you noted when setting it up on the wireless network. You will also need the serial number, which is recorded on the back of the device on the label and on the packing, which was shipped with the device. We need to go into EMC and we will go to our property or our restaurant that we're going to install the device, in this case, the hideaway, and double click that. Within that, we need to go to the setup tab we will go to hardware interfaces, clients and printing, and choose the top item there, workstations. Double click. We now need to add a record for the new all-in-one device. So we'll click on plus, choose object number after currently selected entry, and we will name the record order and pay four, and click OK. We now need to configure a few options for the all-in-one device and we will need to change workstation client to type 7 for the Castle Tech S1F2 and we need to enter our serial number. This is a 12 digit number as I said it's recorded on the packaging and a label on the back of the device. It's very important this number is correct so do check before you save the record. So 12 digits long and the other things we need to configure are the printers for the device. So the printer uses an onboard device and we select that from the list for all of the sorts of data that we want to print locally to Castlepred PTR. So we want to print customer receipt, probably the guest check, memo check if using, certainly the credit card voucher. And we'll select that. Select OK. Now we need to allocate this to a revenue center. So we're going to use this in our default revenue center. So we will select that, default RVC. We've now completed configuration of the order and pay device. So we click save and that will commit it to the EMC. The device is now configured and we're ready to use the all-in-one device once we've ordered it.